What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. So we've all been memeing and joking about how useless our buddy Kev is for months now. Well, today, that all changes. It turns out he has a few magical powers, and he's probably been laughing at us looking for duplication methods and so on. The game has an included dupe bot for everything named Kelvin that requires zero effort from you, and it also works in solo or multiplayer, and you don't even need console commands. All right, so I built a couple Oh god, I almost said something I don't think YouTube would like. Uh, let's call them fun houses for our buddy Kelvin. And I actually need to spawn him in. Um, I killed him about a month ago because he kept chopping down my tree houses. So to do that, um, add character Robbie. Oops, sorry about that, brother. So we'll tell him to follow us. We'll take him in his little workshop. I built this 2x2, two two, but what's even scarier about this is uh, you could build it even bigger. Come on, buddy. Let's go. You're already making me look bad. Come on, dude. I just told everybody that you're not useless anymore. Let's go. Now that we got him in his little fun house, <coughs> we're gonna lock him in here. So before we get him working, I'm gonna toss a drying rack in here. Uh, because he needs to eat. Otherwise he'll take way too many breaks, and we don't want that. I'll toss on some meat, some fish, you know, because I'm such a nice guy. So now we're gonna tell him that we need a couple things. Or a lot of things. So I'll start off by telling him, I need a couple stones. And this is where his magic starts happening. If he can't get out of here, he's just gonna spawn him himself. As a legend. And he'll just keep going. So now that we have Kev1 working, we'll grab another one, and we'll get him collecting some stuff as well. Come on, buddy. Time to get to work. Okay, so we have Kelvin2 in his fun house. And we'll tell him... ...to go grab some sticks. It's like before, since he's stuck in here. He can just miraculously spawn these, and he'll just keep working and working and working. And I'll also give him some meat as well. I'll tell this one to get rocks, which are different than stones. We'll see how he does. I don't see any stone- oh! What a god! People called you useless, Kelvin. How dare they? We'll be back in a little bit, brother. For logs and fish, he doesn't have quite the magic of pulling it out of the ground out of nowhere, uh, but he does get a new superhero trick. If you tell him to get logs or fish when he's locked in a enclosure, apparently he gets uh, cabin fever. Because he'll clip through the wall and teleport to the closest source. And I'll show you what I mean with logs first. With fish, this can be fixed. Um. Well, he proved me wrong. <laughs> Apparently he can spawn logs too now. Usually he clips through the wall. I've never seen this before and I've been testing it for a couple hours. There he goes. And he's already chopping down the, the closest tree. That was weird, I've never seen that before where he was picking up logs out of the ground. Usually he teleports like this. If you do the same thing uh, with fish, 
He'll just teleport to the closest water source. Alright, so I'm gonna put some ridiculous time scale on that'll probably catch my computer on fire and let it sit for, I don't know, five or ten minutes, and we'll see what he's capable of doing. It's been a little while. Let's see how he did. Looks like he got a couple of stones. Still working away. Got a couple sticks. And he got a couple rocks as well. So hopefully I change your mind on, on Kev. He's not so useless. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, and all that other good stuff. Till the next one, I'll see you.